Hello there, YouTube. And welcome to Wednesday, the 24th of January. 46 degrees out here at the moment. I think it's pretty much that when we walk up this morning. But literally moments ago, Typhoon Mary just stopped. I'm sure you can hear all the water pouring from everything. Man, it was flat coming down. <laughs> But I think it's supposed to be rainy most of the day today. It's just that late winter kind of thing. Almost feels like it's uh, like spring because you it goes from crazy pouring down rain to sunshine, pouring down rain, sunshine, flakes of snow. You know that typical spring thing. But anyway, let's uh, let's head to work. And get a work day busted out here. Y'all come on along. Holy moly! Can you guys see the rain? Going sideways out there. What a mess. Looks like it's brighter on the direction we're going, at least. Wow. It's been crazy this morning. It literally woke me up. It was pounding rain so hard. Then you look there and it's, <laughs> there's some blue sky starting to show up. Craziness. All right, time to fill up the old beast again. This time I remembered that I was due for gas. I didn't, I'm not gonna short fill it. <laughs> but that was nice though, got me ahead a little bit. 48 degrees, and mostly rainy. Wasn't as bad as it was in Toledo, thankfully. Yeah, that was a downpour. Yeah, sideways rain. Mm -hmm. But it turned out not so bad, yeah. the farther we got south. But it is wet out here. It it's gonna be a wet day. Yep. It was nice yesterday. I even know, though that snuck in, it wasn't even supposed to be that nice. I got sprinkled on on a test ride, but still it wasn't bad. Yeah. Cool beans, mama. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go in there and start her off hump day. How about that? All right, sounds like a plan. All right, I'll see you as the day goes on, mama. All right. All right, love you, see you, bye. I love you, Bye-bye <laughs> now. Bye. So you guys know, for years now, I've been waving at, at this guy at this corner building down here. There's work. I get to meet him today. <laughs> Oddly enough, I told you, I'm related in a weird way. So uh, I have business business with him this morning. I don't, I couldn't see if he was in his office or not. Not sure where I go in to enter the building. You know what, this kind of looks good right here. I was gonna just walk here, but I, I figured it would probably pour down rain by the time I made it down here. So, uh, anyway, I'll uh, let you know how this goes. It's kind of weird to drive a car down here, though, huh? <laughs> Look at that, blue skies. You watch, it'll be beautiful, and I'll regret. You're going to walk? Okay. I'll regret not walking. That'd have been a nice walk. All right. This will be different. That was easy enough. And uh, I already knew from before this happened, his name is Greg, so I have a name for him. And I uh, got to meet him, we shook hands, and, and we talked a little bit about work, and he goes, I was wondering, I figured you would probably come from Pro Caliber. Well, when the appointment was, appointment was made, he was asking his secretary, I wonder if that's the guy that comes, comes by and, uh, waves I'll do. This guy's probably gonna try to probably t turn my way, huh? There we are. <laughs> nah, I wasn't gonna hit the wall there on the calm down. But yeah, that was cool. There's my little out of the way. He's got a cool office sitting there in the corner. He's a, he's the main dude there. So that's cool. That'd have been way for way more fun. Fun to walk or uh, vlog and everything else but anyway back to the grind hey where's kelly <laughs> she left all right a while ago i went in the back room there to come out and i thought it died <laughs> multitasking all right Geez, I hope this thing has enough power to haul me around. 
Ooh. <laughs> Clutches later than I was expecting. Whee! I love these little 150s. <laughs> I was about to say, I wonder if there's even enough metal in this thing to trigger the, the gate. <laughs> we'll do something a little different this time. We'll go up, go up and around and uh, come back down. Oh man, the power. Look at this, the sun came out. Things started riding up, drying up. <laughs> I was already thinking of the next thing I was gonna say. And Tim was going, why don't you take that one for you? haven't rode that 150. I go, no, I haven't. He goes, that would probably be good for your log. Why don't you take that for a ride? And I go, thanks for the help there, Tim. <laughs> I'll do it. You know how easy it would be to cut the light and just shoot across the parking lot? They do it at our work all the time. They never get in trouble. I'd be the one to drive across there and it'd be the sheriff or something sitting out there, city police or whatever they got around here. I've seen you cutting that lot. <laughs> I mean, they'd literally almost run people, including Kelly and I, over going through our parking lot avoiding the light. It's dangerous out there. I am taking a left here. Pay attention. Get ran over by an MDX. That'd be nice. What happened? I got ran over by an MDX. What a peaceful, smooth-running little guy. Just a cute little thing. Trying to minimize the slingage. They're having to charge up their their Tesla. MDX there. <sighs> Probably shouldn't ride these things. Every time I ride one, I go, oh no. Well, here's my buddy Greg in the office. At least we know who, who we're waving at with each other. <laughs> That's crazy. All them years of <laughs> waving at him. I told you, in a weird way, I was related to him, and someday we'd meet. Well, we did. Oh, yep, just missed it. Splash her through a water puddle there. What's amazing when you're riding this thing is you gotta remind yourself every once in a while. It's carbureted. It runs so amazingly smooth. You'd never know it's carbureted. It just, it fuels so well. You know, and I'm sure it's, you know, lean to meet whatever emissions and BS that goes on, you know. But this thing's, what is it now? This will be the 24th year of production for this thing. This thing's been around forever. Somebody was watching somebody, they're going through some country, and they must have passed like five or six of these things parked on the, you know, side of buildings and homes or whatever they were, you know, it's a little small area. They got some cool colors over there. They go, Kelly, look, some of those little 150s. <laughs> That's a lot cooler now out here cooler out here than I thought. That's a little brisk on you. On my, on my legs. Oh man, we're gonna go so fast, I'm gonna have to put my shield down. Oh yeah, that's got a, that's got a little bit of a bite to it. It's not quite as warm as it was yesterday. It was like 52 yesterday. They're talking about 60-something by this weekend. Or is it next weekend? I think it's this weekend. 
Oops, I'm not going to hit that other one. It's so full of water this time of year that doing a lot of a lot of dodging. Somebody was talking if I'm looking for a Tacoma. Should wait for the 24s to come out. There'll be a four-cylinder turbo. They'll probably get great gas mileage. Yeah, I'm sure they probably will. But nowhere is there room in my life for a small displacement, over-pressurized, turbocharged four-cylinder. <laughs> See how well those things are working out. They may have it just like the new Tundra with the dual turboed V6. Nope, I'd rather have the gas guzzling, good old stone reliable, live half a million miles, no problem, V8 motor in there. These turbos, man, that's just, wow. I don't know what kind of maintenance those things have on them, but I see with the like turbo diesel trucks and stuff like that, different things. Uh, it's, I'll pass. If it gets to a point that you got to get something that's all overpressurized like that, uh, that's about time to start looking at, at electrics, I guess. At least they can have all that power and be reliable about it, I would think. The good old carbureted 150, that'll get me there. Very happily, very reliably, very economical. All at the same time, I don't know how much moss is in them bricks down there, so I'm being a little overly cautious. <laughs> what happened? Well, I went down on this ride in a parking lot. <laughs> Alright, All right, you gotta get that shield down for this crazy speed you can get up to on these things. This thing just kind of cruises along like it doesn't have a worry in the world. Fits like a glove. They're a small bike, but they, they fit just perfect. You don't feel like you're riding a small bike. Whoa, watch it there. Watch it. At least you see me at the last second. <laughs> Gotta give him that. No technicians were damaged in the process. Dual sport. And a big old mound of snow. I hate to tell you, how many times in the past, and I lived in Longview, there's always snow up on the hill there. Like feet of snow, it seemed like. Because of the elevation we were at. Oh man, them snow piles were so much fun. It was really fun on get some little bikes, you know, because always had XL, XR, 75s, little XR 100s, and just go bombing around the neighborhood hitting those big old piles, and you could literally lose your day messing with those things. What you gonna do? You gonna block me off so I can oh, no, I can still turn around down here. Alright, let's do a quick quickie walk. I didn't wipe this thing down. It comes with a, a plastic all over everything. And that plastic it le <laughs> leaves marks on the on the fenders and stuff. I don't know if I can make any of that show up. Maybe I can there. It almost looks like there's some kind of a like a design in it. See it in there? That's just where all those plastic wrappers look like. You know, it's kind of like thick cellophane that was on it all over it. <laughs> that does look good. I need to stay off of these things. That is the perfect, perfect Grom chaser right there. They <laughs> almost have about the same performance. She's pretty. Yeah, it wouldn't take much to talk me into one of those things. Look at the old Kian carburetor. Looks like the same carburetor they've been using for a hundred years. The old drum brakes in the back. 
the old 80s master cylinder and caliper and stuff on there look at this a cable operated speedo drive heck yeah there's nothing wrong with any of those things for all those years and now they're just gone it's all high techy highfalutin stuff now <laughs> boom boom uh, looks like some scary clouds coming this way that's a noisy tires on that truck wasn't it I don't know how quick I want to accelerate a new motorcycle here so I'm going to wait I got to Got a good run. Yeah. It just kind of putters right along. <laughs> what a sweetheart. Retails like 29 something on them. That's a lot of, a lot of bang for the buck there. Many miles of some crazy fun. I didn't even hit my turn signal. I thought I did. I was just wondering if the... I'm, I remember checking the turn signals. I don't know if I checked the dash to make sure the dash worked. And she does. Nice little Honda logo in there. Alright. <laughs> Thanks for coming for a quick little test ride. Uh, I didn't get wet. All right, lovely 2023 XR 150L. Well, hello there, you two. Out here late tonight. Mm -hmm. At least it's not pouring down rain. Yeah. It must have absolutely poured like heck down here. Yeah. The yard, flooding. that one spot, is flooded. The dog's pinned. It's flooded. Everything's flooded out here. Yeah, it's a mess. It must have been crazy. We were coming the last part coming here. We left Vancouver and his blue skies and it's nice that we're driving that time of night and you can still see out and all that stuff and it all went wrong. We got up yes, north here. Did. Then we pulled in and pulled in the driveway and just water everywhere. Man, it was flooded. Yeah, it was so, warm. <laughs> some crazy stuff must have been going down here. Mm-hmm. But anyway, the way it goes. This time of year, I reckon. Mm -hmm. but that was fun. Got yeah. to finally <laughs> meet meet Greg, guy we've been waving at for all these years, and and then uh, also ride another one of those ones. I still got another one to ride too. So very cool. But anyway, been, I was just taking a break from the test. I said that one I haven't ridden. We need to we need to go. So that was a dry spot. We went. Very nice. Oh, it's kind of late. I got a vlog to build, so I think we're going to roll. All righty. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And you guys have an amazing Thursday or Friday. Heck yeah. All right. We see you in the morning. Till the morning. <laughs> Thanks for watching now. Bye-bye.